Whenever you have this much money in art game, you're sure to attract some beggars over to you. And today I'm going to show you how to deal with said beggars in the most fun way possible. Hey everyone, Schwalnuts here. Welcome back to Starving Artists. My most recent video on this game popped off for whatever the heck reason. So I thought I would cash in on that and make another video because why the heck not? As I said in the intro, there is a lot of beggars in this game. See, look at this server for example. The second person on the leaderboard has sold 17 Bobux worth and I've sold 22,000 worth. A lot of people ask me for some of that 22,000 and I give them the same response every time. Well, sometimes some of the same responses. I, I like to vary it up because funny. Some people walk up to me and say like, oh, can you see my art? And I'll tell them, no, I'm blind. And it's hilarious because they don't know what to do. Considering I don't see any beggars in this server, uh, I'm going to server hop. Wait, hang on a second. Right, hold on. Uh, uh, it's 15 Bobux, but you know what? I'm A-OK -okay with that. I only have 170, but uh, I'm going to dip into that fund real quick and buy me one of these event arts. This guy just put an exploded art up for sale. There we go. Look at that. Another art. Oh, and a little update to the last art thingy I made. Um, I currently have 10, 20, 29, 39, 48, 58, uh, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65. I have 65 Halloween arts right now. That's a lot of Halloween art. Also, somebody drew me in a... <laughs> I love it. You may have seen this minion. Listen, whenever I see a minion that looks like this... How are you supposed to walk past that? Like, that is the rarest unique art I've ever seen. It's so rare and unique that I don't think anybody would ever consider drawing this. But I bought it because, you know, it was it was 10 Robux. And, wait, no, its value is 41. Who has been buying this? It's still the Halloween event, by the way. So, you know, that's not gone yet. So be sure to stock up on those Halloween event arts because they're funny arts and they're going to sell for a lot. I can't promise they'll sell for a lot, but they'll definitely sell for more than you paid. In unless you paid like 50 or up bow bucks then well you're probably losing profit what a nice day at the beach he's dead want to check out my arts i'm blind sorry man i i can't see your arts it's just how it goes look he doesn't know what to do now he's bamboozled he's baffled he's confused he doesn't know what to do with himself anymore he's coming back see look just like that he didn't even try asking again I just hit him with the I'm blind and he's like, all right, <laughs> cack und ball torture. I don't remember what I was going to say earlier. I've, I've lost my train of thought. I, I, I got distracted by saying I'm blind to somebody. I, I don't remember. <laughs> oh yeah, let me show you my booth real quick. I've, I've changed a little bit. So I took all the Halloween event art down because, well, people probably wouldn't buy it for how much I had it up for it, but uh, I'm selling a bunch of new art and it's some high quality art. I even got uh, the bronies. Look, the bronies can come buy something. You even got Terraria yo-yo. I love the Terrarium. It's an awesome yo-yo. At least I think that's what it's called. I haven't played Terraria for a while. My bad for the lack of uploads, by the way. My computer, for some reason, is having issues rendering. Um, I'm gonna take a wild guess and say it's because I haven't powered off my computer for a while because I've been too busy AFKing this game. But, like, listen, the profits speak for themselves. On one hand, my computer completely dies. On the other hand, a little bit of bow bucks. Like, I mean, you, got, you gotta weigh your options here. And, basically, for the past week, I've just been playing Stardew Valley. And, yeah, <laughs> I've just been playing something that doesn't require much loading. I'm still pissed that I can't remember what I was gonna say earlier. I'm not happy about that, but I'm gonna server hop to turn down some more beggars because why not? Am I mean for doing this? Like, am I mean for just purposely server hopping just to tell people no? <laughs> Begging in this game is a problem and people really, really like to beg. Whenever they see you, they see dollar signs and they just wanna ask you for your money. And you just gotta be blunt with them. You gotta tell them no, unless their art's actually good. All right, I'll stand here for a little bit and see what happens. See if anybody comes up to me and is like, hey, buy my art. I figured out what I was gonna say. Whenever people come up to you in this game, and they hit you with a simple hello or a hi, you know what's gonna come next. I've seen it so many times before. Not one person has said hello and then said like something other than can you come buy my art or can you see my art? Anytime you see the words yo, hi, or hello, it is going to be followed up by can you buy my art or can you check out my art? Not once has it not been that. Can anyone buy my art? I'm on my way saving to get core blocks. I don't have very much so far. Anything will help me on this journey, heart. <laughs> How much is core blocks? <laughs> I need to double check this because I don't remember. Let me show you what happened. So I type in core blocks and I'm like, okay, core blocks avatar shop. And that's what I wanted to like click on. But no. So uh, here's core blocks core blocks core blocks and avatar shop let's see how far off she was it is 17,000 she had uh 53 let me let me do some math real quick so 17,000 minus 53 
Eh, she she's almost there. She's got 16,947 Bobux to go. I believe in her. I'm such a menace in this game because whenever people come up to me and say like hi or hello, usually I'm like vocally berating them. I'm not typing it, but I'm usually just like, man, why do you have to beg? Like, come on. It's just the most annoying thing. And I'm just like getting so frustrated with them vocally, but they, they have no idea. Unless I accidentally leave my voice chat on then. Well, they probably have a pretty good idea. What's this guy saying OMG about? I am a big fan. Yo, that's epic. Don't worry. If you're if you're watching this, you're in the video. Hey, <laughs> yo. Hi, Daniel. How you doing? I just watched your video today to get the limited Halloween panic. Yo, look at that. People are recognizing it. Hi, YouTube. Yo, this is awesome. This has never happened, but this is this is so cool. Look at this. Look at everybody. You know what? This is cool. I got the painting too. Good for you, man. I'm happy. It was really cool. You know, one time I was playing this game and somebody came up to me and they were like, Oh, MG Schwalnuts, you're my hero. Like, it, out of nowhere, they followed me around the whole game. Like, it, it's just a, a weird feeling I've never had before. It's kind of awesome. I don't think the cars outside agree, though. I'm gonna drink some Gatorade. You just stop drinking so much Gatorade. I'm not even gonna lie. My diet the past few days has just been Takis and Gatorade. And I think my Roblox just crashed. Thanks, Roblox. Thanks for cooperating with me. Has anybody else's Roblox been buggy lately, or is it just mine? Mine just doesn't want to work. One of the most annoying things in this game, this is on, on topic, off topic, I don't know what to call it. One of the most annoying things in this game is whenever you haven't even loaded in yet, somebody runs up to you and says, can you buy my art? That has happened to me multiple times, and it takes my all not to just be like, bro, shut up up you know i'm not finding any beggars usually i find a ton like unironically i find so many hello shadow how you doing on this fine sunday afternoon this is a problem with waiting in these type of games i don't have the patience i have the attention span of a two second old fly you know of course the one time i start recording to complain about beggars there is no beggars i can't make a video about beggars on roblox if there is no beggars on roblox yo honestly one thing i realized with this avatar and it, it bothers me like you see this Look how I'm looking on my face. There's no line. But when I zoom out, why is this line on my face? Like, there's just a line there. But whenever I get super up close and personal with my character, you know, there, there's no line there. No matter which way I turn it. I need to resist the urge to spend 15 again. I, I already have 65, I think, paintings. I, I don't need another one. It's mine now. Why is there a Crocs Roblox event? What is this? Crocs World Minigames. Why? <sighs> okay. Let's see what's popping on this server. Put the Gatorade down. <laughs> Would you like to buy Be Handsome like Shrek? Well, yeah, I'd love to. All the girls are gonna start flocking in now because I'm gonna be like Handsome Shrek because I just bought it. So let me just re-go over the tips that I said about beggars because obviously I can't find any of these little rodents anywhere. If someone comes up to you and they say hi or hello or yo or hey, expect them to follow up with, oh, can you buy my art or can you see my art? To which you can respond the following. If they say, can you see my art? You could tell them that you're blind because they're not going to argue with a blind person. If they ask you to buy their art, just tell them you don't have money. Even if that's a lie. Like I used to tell people I had no money when I had like 10,000 po bucks. <laughs> just because I don't want to buy their art. Listen, if you ask me to buy your art, I'm not going to. Because whenever you ask me to buy your art, I feel like it's an obligation to buy your art, which I'm not going to do. I can't find any beggars. I'm upset because this video is going to be about beggars. I'm still going to make the thumbnail and title about beggars because, well, people really want to know how to deal with them. And, well, might as well just cash in on that while I can. But for the meantime, that's right. It's croc time. Today is National Croc Day at the time I'm recording this. And it's time to play some Roblox croc game for whatever the heck reason. I'm in a croc coaster. Let's go. I'm zooming through the croc land. Free crocs UGC. I need to get that. Play three mini games in Crocs World or complete the Is this Crocs World mini games? I gotta go to these mini games. Something's exploding and I don't know what. All right, boys, we gotta get this croc real quick. Crocky bro. <laughs> Press three. No. I'm not doing that. I'm too busy crocking it up. Look at that. Look how good I am at- I'm so good at croc land. I have to do that two more times to win, by the way. I don't want to do that two more times, but I need this croc. Come here, Shun. Yes. I won. I did it. I'm the best at this game. I've won all three mini games. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Uh, now we have to go back and go to the concert. To the concert. Croc my way there. Portal activate 20 minutes before the concert start. When's the concert start? Oh my gosh. I have to wait six and a half hours to go to the concert. 
I'm not doing that. So yeah, that, that's how you deal with beggars and how you get the croc head in Roblox. I, I don't know what type of turn this video took, but here we are. So yeah, oh, bye bye. Hey, got a new hoe and I got a new flow. Well, subtract that first part though. Multiply that by two, oh no. Two times oh is still zero. Hey, that's just basic math. Even though I failed my math class, now I kind of feel like a dumbass. Don't know what to rhyme with dumbass. Hey, got a new hoe and I got a new flow. Well, subtract that first part though. Multiply that by two, oh no. Two times oh is still zero.